Kanban is a Japanese word that means sign or signal. The lean tool of the same name is an inventory and to-do list management system. It's a simple visual way of managing tasks that should be seen by everyone in an organization, or at least those to the board it directly pertains to. Here's what one looks like. In its simplest form, you have to do, doing, and done columns. As needed, someone would put up things to do to order new tasks, maybe like making compounds, and this would trigger an action to accomplish those tasks. This is all based on a pull system. When something gets pulled, an action is triggered. Say we're in the clean room and we pulled the last syringe or the fifth to last syringe, and our syringes are now below a certain par level that we've set. A Kanban is pulled or a signal is put in place. It could be that you grab the bin that holds the syringes and it's moved to a different location to signal it's low. It could be a card to let you know how many to pull from inventory to replenish the clean room stock. Another reason this works so nicely is that it helps with never being out of stock in certain areas of the pharmacy, particularly the clean room. This could mean delaying a whole process because you may be shorthanded with a particular item or something wasn't sterilized. Utilizing lists in a Kanban system to organize would prevent this sort of situation. Standardization is the key here. So don't make this overly complicated because there are phone apps and web-based solutions for implementing this. The simpler, the better. If it's not simple, you won't have 100% participation and this is a variation. And variations aren't good. Here's my board I have hanging in the pharmacy. It's in the main room of the pharmacy that we spend basically 75% of our time. There's only three of us in my pharmacy, so it's, it's easy to see there's something on the board that needs to be done and we can all get together and divide it up or, or just ask someone to accomplish the task that's posted. We use this quite a bit in our pharmacy, which maintains a good level of inventory at all times and keeps us on task. For instance, if there's a compound we need to make because of a batch we just dispensed or pulled the last one, we make a Kanban and tack it to the board during our busy time. This is the easiest way I've found to keep things simple and compounds moving throughout the pharmacy. But this isn't just a fancy board. A few things within the organization have to be changed to make it all work. The idea of having minimal inventory can be a scary thought, especially if no back-end work has been done. I no longer keep 30 kilos of progesterone on hand. Instead, I've set up a blanket agreement with one of my suppliers to hold stock and next day it whenever I need it. That way, when a Kanban is in play, we know to look at the stock levels of all the required materials for a compounding progesterone, including preparing glassware and other items for sterilization, as well as ordering progesterone powder in a timely fashion. I have only what I need in stock when I need it. And when I need something at my facility, it's brought in just in time, and I need to know when that time is, as signaled by a Kanban. So you can see how these lean tools start working together. I should also mention that this can be used in your personal life as well, where your wife is maybe putting things on the board for you to accomplish by the end of the week. At least that's how I use it. <laughs>